for investors, it's tough to beat the S&P 500. But a lot of you out there may have mutual funds that are claiming to be different. And <laughs> this is where I want to give you a heads up. This is the hot tip. Yep. Okay. There's a statistical data point that we use called R squared. You go on Google and you can find it. It's publicly available. R squared, what it's really telling you is how much of the movement in price for my investment can be explained by its benchmark. So if Or the, the underlying index, right? Well, so yeah. the benchmark in this case, if it's the S&P 500 and you're trying to outperform the S&P 500, you want to say, well, how much of the return that I'm getting would I have gotten if I just owned the S&P 500? Right. And the, the, the threshold is somewhere above 0.9 because it's up, it's up to one, right? That's the, the so, so your one R squared doesn't like, go above one. So if you just invested in the S&P 500 and you're like, what's my R squared? It's, it's going to be one, one because yes. your performance, like it if is. you were to chart it, yeah. is going to directly overlap the well, same and, 